Hey everyone, this is Philip with LW Scientific and I just wanted to show you how easy it is to put together our new iSeries scope, including even the Epi module. So bear with me. Alright, you've got the head of the microscope as well as the base. Now, typically the entire scope is pretty much assembled. All you have to simply do is screw on each one of the objectives and then I'm going to show you how to secure the head onto the microscope do the eyepieces plug it in and there you go ready to operate your scope uh, first just undo this particular screw mount right here and then simply remove the black piece up here and as you'll notice uh, once you unbag the actual head of the microscope it has two caps to where the eyepieces go you can simply remove those as well as the protective cover for the head of the microscope where the prisms are. And as you notice, there is one particular little notch right here. It simply is form-fitting up onto the top of the scope. Let's see if I can do this backwards. Um, get up here. And then slide it around. And then keep a firm handle onto the top of the head so it doesn't tilt forward and fall off. It shouldn't fall off, but always keep one hand up here until it's firmly secured. And then simply grab the securing screw right here and twist it. Remember righty tighty, lefty loosey. And then just give it a firm little twist and now it's secured. And then grab your eye pieces. And then, the very small cord, um, which is the 12 volt adapter, um, and as you'll see, it's only a 2.5 or 2.8 um, jack that goes into the back, as the LED light source doesn't require hardly any power at all. And, Plug it in, cut it on, and now you're done. 